Hey, Fierce and Fam, and welcome back to what we haven't done in a couple of weeks, but we're back at it. It is the terrible movie of the... Ah, excuse you. Oh, what happened there? Not sure. Oh, my. It is the terrible movie of the week. Um, and we apologize. It's been like two weeks since we've done these movies, um, but we're back at it. And tonight's movie is... Adam Age Vampire. From 1916. And this is a request from our patron Lawrence. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm assuming it's about a vampire. Yeah, well, I mean, it's in the name. Adam. It says <laughs> Adam Age, but Adam, not the name Adam. It's like Adam, like a... Buddy Adams. Yeah, so... Not sure well, um, what that's going to be about. Yeah. So should we just give the people what they want? Yeah, let's uh, hop right into it. All right, enjoy. Oh, don't. I know y'all missed that. No. I like that at least they went for some better font. <laughs> Give credit. Pierre! Go put some clothes on. I won't be a minute. Pierre! It's all over. <clears throat> you had your choice? Either me or the so-called profession you're working at. You're still working, so that means I'm through. Oh, please don't treat me like this. You know your ship is about to sail. Better for us. It's easier if I go away. Easier to what? To suffer even more than we both have already? You know we belong to each other, Pierre. Oh, please, Jeanette. That's in the snow. No. Bye. Pierre! There's a lot of people out there. They want you to do another number. I won't do another number. I'm fed up with this job. No. She wants Pierre. Good for you, girl. You go get him. I'm not sure if she what she wants. She didn't have clothes on. Was she a stripper? Um, assuming, yeah. You can't see well, that's why. You gotta put your light your um what do you call them? Bright headlights. Well yeah, always. Put your bright lights. No? Okay. Oh no. I could read the truth in the eyes of Professor Moray. There isn't a bit of hope for me. Mutilated. Disfigured. Forever. You might as well be prepared for the worst. But it won't make any difference to someone who really loves you. At least you're alive. Mm-hmm. At least we can come and teach. Leave me alone! <laughs> hey, excuse me. It's not that bad. No. You're alive, darling. No. You mustn't give up all hope yet. Who are you? Don't ask me questions. There isn't time. I'm an assistant to a great scientist who has come to hear of your case and wants to know more about you. (laughs) Not a word to a soul. What are you looking at? This is the only hope you have. Keep that in mind, always. You will drop out of sight for a short time. Three or four weeks at the very most. And when you reappear, everything will be as it was before. More than it ever seems before, like, I mean, we haven't seen this type of movie in a bit. But remember when we started? They were all like this. Labs. Totally yeah. Cells. Can we spice it up a little it bit? Yeah. Yeah. successful in correcting abnormal cell growth, nice. as well as Aww, restoring cells that have been destroyed. Aww. Just as good often grows out of evil. Derma 28 has grown out of Derma 25. But we've been injecting in so many of those poor little animals. Transforming them into monsters. You're aware of its effects. Look at that. Oh. Come on. You'll have to be exposed to treatment at once in the radiation chamber. No. Give me an injection of Derma 28. But you know it's never been tried on human beings. I wouldn't have the courage. That's just why I did it. To force you to have the courage. No. Let's wait for the girl Jeanette Morino. No. I want to share this honor with you. I've never been as near to you before as I am at this moment. And you will always remember it. We don't need you. Sasha, don't be troubled about me. When it's all over, you can bring me some roses. Yes. It's a miracle. There is not the slightest doubt any longer. Do you see? It removes every trace of degeneration of cell structure. They haven't turned you into something you don't want to be. It's a day that comes but once in a lifetime. 
I that turned is on. our lifetime. I'm attracted to you. That's right. I shall always remember everything you've done for me. Thank you. Tell me that in some other way. Monique, you're not priority. <laughs> that other guy can take you out to dinner. So you guys found this one guy's already found us too long. And yeah. it you. <laughs> I know. Why do you look at me that way? For a moment there, you seem to be performing some sacred ritual. Is this Professor Levin? Okay, that look was a little creepy. Yeah. He's like... <clears throat> It looks like it's the same. So you've come was... to us. I'm happy to see you. It's and your luggage? Like the it's same house set up as the other one. Where's the From the guy that was locked behind the. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. You help him. Come now. Show me your face. Show me your face, I said. Why are you so aggressive, doctor? That it's beyond control, like leprosy. <gasps> There's no one who can It's help. not that bad. Calm no. down. Let me go away, please. <laughs> I give you my word that I will restore your faith. Why didn't you do it before? Why is he this? such a dick? You're condemned for the rest of your life. And you know it. She knows. They all told you. It's been a little rough. <laughs> all right. Let me kill myself right now. <laughs> if you really are so desperate, take your own life if you want to. Yes. I'll give this back to you. But only on that day when you look me in the face and tell me that I failed you. Do you understand, Jeanette? Doesn't even look but that until bad. That day comes. Mm -mm. <laughs> Will you try? No, no, I beg of you. <laughs> She's fainted. I've had a room prepared. The beautiful human specimen. Yeah, I wouldn't wear it like that. It's... Beautiful? No. For here at the clinic? It's all beyond me. She told us she was going back to that apartment hotel where she lived. The same hotel tour. Jeanette must still be in town. <clears throat> or it might mean that she's gone away. But Jeanette only wants Pierre. Okay, bro. Uh, Stop it. I don't trust a man who would call me a specimen. Thank you. No. It's as if I were afraid. Of what? Will there be after effects now? Will the regeneration of cells continue as it should? I'm sure it will. Um, sure is not the yeah. same as no. no. You? Yes, Jeanette. It's Professor Levin, the man who has... Give me your hand. to Jeanette. The miracle has happened to you. And you will remain with us until we are sure that we can proclaim it to the entire world. Oh, how long you got kidnapped there? Another one. Not kidnapped, but held there. Don't you feel happy? We're being held hostage Don't here. you want to laugh yeah. and sing for joy? <laughs> I wonder why she hasn't returned. I suppose she has an experiment she's working on. I loved you, I would surely tell you. Yeah, she, she's, oh. I'll tell you, you love me. Oh. 
Well, you able to that's see not how that works. No. Heart, and you're still too upset by everything that has happened in your life. But you love me. You must know you love me. I think it's the opposite, sir. I have snatched sir. you away from desperation and from death. It is I who restored your beauty. Just because he it helped you. It is I who need you. I'll never be able to live without you. Push him off. Wait one moment. I don't think she can hear you. Albert. Oh, I thought oh. she had. Tell okay. me what it is. Nothing. Nothing at all. Something rather urgent, which I forgot to tell Monique. Monique! 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 Oh, I don't know what's wrong. It's just though my face were on fire. Sit down here a moment. Just relax. You're very tired. Now she will sleep soundly for several hours. Time is pressing. Move her to the laboratory at once. What? It what must be a success. It must be, understand? Don't count any longer on me. Monique! She means more to you now than just an experiment. Monique! I cannot do it without you. Then I'll make a condition. You know what it is. She mustn't suffer like this. Like there's always surgery. And insertion. You're out of your I mind. That's it. It's the only possible solution. I'll transplant directly Tim from another Bro's human being those plants which produce Derma 28. He's going to make from her worse. Woman, a young one. Out there. You must be insane. You've gone mad over her. I gave you my solemn word. No, I know that I can't trust you. How will you ever accomplish it? By murdering the first woman that passes. And if the after picture looks different, you'll kill another woman and another. I promise we will send her far away. Far away. I will forget her. We will start all over again and be successful. Until you find somebody else and then there's a fatuation again, idiot. You know, I would kill a thousand so times before I would admit defeat. Monique, tail it out of there. Let's go. <laughs> Take the other guy with you. He likes you more. Please be reasonable. You're a little aggressive, sir. When someone needs to punch right? you in the side the of the head. Isn't he right? The way he touches them. Someone needs to punch you in the side of the head. The other guy does. Paralysis of the heart. It's quite obvious. Uh huh. He killed her. Showed no symptoms. No warning beforehand. Oh yes. I have kept her under special care for almost two years. I'll make out a certificate at once. Without an autopsy? An autopsy. I've already confirmed the diagnosis given by Dr. Levitt. Without a consideration. Don't trust no, no. him. If it's usual practice, Inspector, if the decision lies within my jurisdiction, I say no autopsy. Oh, no. If one isn't necessary. Absolutely not. Where are we going? I'm not sure. You gotta throw her overboard. <laughs> he pushes her off the edge of the cliff. Jeez. Today I'm glad to be alive. Thank you for making me so happy. I didn't want you to get the impression that you're a prisoner there. On my account, to necessity you are. of keeping everything a secret. And he keeps drugging her. What are you looking at? The water. The water? Yes, I'm sorry. Isn't there any music? The monster. The monster who doesn't fear killing. Who doesn't suffer and is killed? What are you doing? You're so weird, man. Oh, he's inserting it himself? Mm-hmm. Lady. Here, I'll give you anything you ask. All what? right. You really gave me a turn. What are we playing? Hide and seek? Oh. She's so stupid, though, being like, all right. Why would you even acknowledge him? Wouldn't you run? I would have just taken off if I was the only one on the street, especially. Yeah. What do I got to do with you? Well, I'd say you might want to put better clothes on if you're not trying to, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Oh. Are you convinced now? Oh, but... Think calmly. I mean, I know she's in her nightwear, but still. 
I know. You're thinking of yesterday. I'm still upset myself. You're afraid the cure will not be permanent. But you're mistaken. Now it's only a question of cell growth. I've already solved this problem. Oh, leave me alone, Albert. Please go. She told you. Get back back off. off. We can see each other later out the garden. She told you like the first time. Seriously. Come on, hurry. Get the bar set up. All right. Come on, Pierre. Rescue her. I'm ready to go. Well, look who's here. Pierre. Oh. <laughs> it's been ages. How are you? That was a Don't weird hug. Pining for me. Well, I have. If you want to know. Hi, Yvonne. Am I wrong? Or are you getting fatter? It's becoming, oh, isn't it? Pierre, never mind. Stay there. Hey, good evening. Pierre, you're a jerk, too. A carton of cigarettes if you play me something. Pierre more needs ship. And it's docked here today. Oh. Where's the key to the front gate? Idiot! Leave him alone. Hurry, come with me. Not after you slap me. Hey, lady. Hey, what is that? Come aboard. No, thanks. I'd rather oh, that's a cat. I thought that was a really big mouse. No, it's a kitty cat. Oh, it's like, what is that thing? Um, it's gonna look like a jumping mouse from. Oh, it's Pete. Is it Pierre? Pierre! Yeah. Well, now I hate to be heard, Dane. Hey, but imagine she gains a little weight. He goes, Did you get fat? I know. What a prick. You've recovered. Why didn't they tell me at the clinic when I looked for you? But they told me you'd always be disfigured. Didn't you ever want to see me? It was the truth, Pierre, the truth, I swear. Where were you staying? What happened to you? Didn't you receive my letter? What letter? Oh, Pierre, take me away. I'm so frightened. Of what? Tell me. Ah. 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 Okay. I can't even feel bad for her now. You don't see them taking her off? And you're positive that she's the same person. There's no doubt about it. And this one showing the scars was given to me at the clinic that's on her way disfigured forever. Yes, yes. The photographs are of the same girl, I agree. But I was referring to the person you met tonight on the waterfront. You don't think that... Oh, perhaps... no, Commissioner. It was she in front of me. But in the dark, with the fog at all. They were close enough. I think I he knows what he is, what he saw. So, so Jeanette Morino listed with the Bureau of Missing Persons. But she's not a missing person. She's here. I've seen her. Ah, right. Excuse me. I had another purpose in coming here to see you. Look here. Examine these two photos. Do you believe that a woman reduced to such a state as this might recover altogether? What I mean is without any scar, without a trace. I should say not. This state of disfiguration is permanent. Nevertheless, Professor, Let I... Let me do the talking to Anne. They're so aggressive in this movie. there is someone who swears that he's seen this woman the way she was. That's impossible. And if there did exist a cure, I don't know, a process we never heard Any of. Any man who had discovered one would be a celebrity. Mm -hmm. And I assure you, I'd be the first to envy him. He doesn't want to look at flowers. Leave him alone. <laughs> this is Sasha's kingdom. There are his plants. There are his roses. Sasha, you're honored. These gentlemen have come to admire your beautiful greenhouse. It's really beautiful, too. Well, you ought to know. Flowers, nothing else of any interest. And Sasha is always busy with them. He doesn't even have time to read mystery stories. Yes, and no wonder. Well, good night, Professor. And excuse us again. Sasha, accompany the gentlemen to the gate. Jeanette. Oh, no. What is the purpose of this autopsy? Now, Doctor, I've already arranged for the body to be exhumed, and I must ask you to proceed without any further argument. Very well, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Garage, I want my car at the door in ten minutes. Janet, what are you shouting for? 
What's wrong with you? No, let go of me. I want to get out of here. I'm afraid. Of me? Of the man to whom you owe everything and who loves you? You're not telling the truth. You want to go back oh, to Pierre. But I'm going to save you now in spite of yourself. Yes, I want to go to Pierre. I don't care if I'm scarred for life because I know now that he will love me anyway. I'll be back in a couple of hours. Escape, girl. Come on, Sasha. Follow us. Step on it. Very good. In his automobile. Have you arranged for reinforcements? Take all precautions. Exactly where is he at the moment? Watch yourself now, Buster. Let's not start on your bed, huh? <laughs> May I have a light, please? Oh no, he switched with somebody. Thank you. Oh no. Ah! I got this guy. Oh, the dog. Yeah, baby. That was bad acting, but good job and they I'm glad they somebody had a dog. Yes. Another woman. In the waterfront neighborhood again, but is the woman dead? Gerard's telling him we're waiting here for further instructions. I told you, Chief. Were you both inside the whole time? No, we both took turns. He didn't move one. That one. Let's go in. This row here. God, this is so boring. This one. He was sitting in this seat. And you never let him out of your sight, huh? Well, I slipped outside for a minute to buy some cigarettes. But I never let him out of sight. And who was there sitting next to you? If what I think is true, you'll be back in a beaten uniform. That reminds me, what was he wearing? Yes, what did he have on? You could see that he was wearing a camel's hair coat, Inspector. Yeah, that's like opening a phone book for the name Smith. Then this. Please forgive me. It's too late now to make any difference, and there's nothing more I can do to help you. There's no hope of your recovery. You will remain as you... No. It's impossible. The treatments have taken effect at last. Oh, uh, yeah. They're trying to, like, focus on the sex appeal or what? I've even killed for you. Hey, she didn't ask I you to do that. You. No. I've unleashed a horrible force within me that I can no longer control. Get the bed, rip you the bedpost off. Me. Stop it. Dab him. Tell me that you will never abandon me now. No! Look again. You begin to understand now. <laughs> Tell me you belong to me, that you will run oh, away. Oh, this better end wrap up soon. I ignored it off like a couple of times. It was getting me so mad. Oh, no, it's horrible. Janet. Let go of me. Shoot him. Oh, my. And murder the man who condemned himself for you. But you will never see your Pierre again. You are mine. Mine. Oh, my God. I kill you first. Now get dressed. Well, the curtain's so sheer he can see her. Okay. Yeah, this is... Have you no pity? Oh. That's what I ask of you. The Titus is a vampire, and there have been one vampire in here. Adam vampire, like, in case you like young, you know, I guess. I guess. Well, why did you just fall down? Why didn't you keep running? Why do you keep slamming up against the wall? Keep running, Tom Tom. <laughs> you know they never want to write a smart lady in half. No, films. they don't. Why well, was one of the few smart ladies one without a body? Yeah. From the brain that wouldn't die. Yep, I remember. Oh, get your. Oh, you don't have your gun now, do you? Why do they 
always write the ladies to just stand there. Uh, right? I, I don't know. Because remember, they didn't think much of the ladies in the 60s. That's pretty much it. They thought they couldn't fend for themselves and stuff. Oh my god. Seriously, dude. Why does she faint all the time? Notice that? She's painted like three or four times already. Fire a volley through the window pane. Oh my god. Come out, Levin! Come out with your hands up! No. Jeanette! Yeah. No, come back! Go, Sasha. Go, Sasha, go. What do you have? Was it a knife? I think so. Or like a, like a sharp gardening tool. Maybe. You know the clip the... Yeah, oh yeah. Stop. Yeah, yeah. Stop. Give me a light. Huh. That was so stupid. This guy was like useless with a cigarette. Really? Yeah. <sighs> that was Adam Age Vampire from 1916. I was expecting vampires. So I'm sorely disappointed. It was... It started out... The last decent. half of that film Boring. was nodding off. Boring. What would you rate it? Giving it a one or two would be gracious. <laughs> no, I was thinking a five and I thought that is too good for this movie. That's way too good for this movie. Like a two? I'm giving it a one, one and a half. I was falling asleep in the last 30 minutes of that film. Yeah, I mean, some of it was like, uh, you know, decent pace. And then when it just took a dump After and he stole the lady, it went super slow. Oh my God. Like them trying to figure out who it was and... And everything, it's like, oh my lanta. And the acting was terrible. Yeah. Um, the it, voice actors for the English were working with what they had. I, I mean, think. it it could have potentially been a promising movie. The premise was there. It's it just, just most of it dragged on, and then yeah, yes, it was just. And then the whole they could have cut out the scene with like. With him, with when the dog, which was great, I liked that the dog attacked him when he was trying to. Right, that could have been left out. He could have just snuck out, or I don't know. I don't even know I don't what to want say to think on this. About this film. I was falling asleep. Yeah, yeah. So you give it a one and a half? Not even that. A one. That's being gracious. I could have given it a zero. I know. I'll give it a two and be gracious, just because it, it the 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 parts were ish. But I'm sorely disappointed that this was not vampires. I guess Adam Vampire, meaning like you said, like it de-aged him like with him. But then he went into Rady. I mean, the... not de-aged, but like it made him like, 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 uh, you know how vampires I... usually like clean cut kind of like. Oh, yeah. But he, it was only when he went into that radiation and took that drug that he turned into like this beast. Changed, yeah. Because it was so... changing the Adam. So Adam Vampire was turning him back. Or... <sighs> that was a, you know, that was a terrible name for this movie. Uh, I don't know. Nothing else fun. to say on this one. Oh. Um, well, that was um, a waste of my life. <laughs> that's an hour and we won't get back from this one. Mm -hmm. Um, but again, we just appreciate the bad movies. That's what they're there for. They're not always going to be hits and mm -hmm. you know what I mean? What you doing? Can oh, I finish? Just saying, yeah, okay, yeah. wait. So that's mine's out of my I'm not head. putting it. It's not going to oh. show up. It's just there. Okay. Um, you know, so that's just what they're, they're, they're bad movies for a reason, you know? Um, so, um, you could go ahead and you have some more, you can put them on the recommendation form for us. We enjoy doing them again. Apologies that it had been two weeks. It's just, you know, thing, life happens and you know, whatever. So we're going to be doing a bad movie and then a normal movie. Um, and then, um, a short each week for YouTube. 
And then on exclusive, we'll be probably, now we'll be doing like every other week, will be an exclusive movie. And then it'll also be Breaking Bad. So mm-hmm. um, we included all the links for all that. And we'll let you know when they're going up on um, either as early releases coming to YouTube. Oh my God. Or when they're exclusive, we'll put them on the community tab per request. So we'll go ahead and do that. Um, Again, if you want to join Team Patreon, Mm -hmm. you know, with all the exclusive. We have a buttload of really good exclusive content on there. Yeah. And so we've got coming up this week Collateral. Mm -hmm. And then we also... In the, um, after that, we have Goonies, and then we have the a, a Simple Twist of Fate. Yeah, we have the producers at some point. Well, that was from our general poll, but I mean, it's oh. exclusive, exclusive yeah. wise, yes. Um, so go ahead. I don't even remember what some of these were. Yeah, so we've got those, you know, coming up as well. And, you know, of course, you always, um, if you're in the $8 tier and above, you partake in our exclusive poll. So that's what, how we decide. Um, and then just in general, if you just want to take advantage of our $1. <laughs> You know, you get exclusive. I mean, you get um, mm-hmm. access to our monthly polls as well. So, and a new one's coming up on October first. So, um, which is Tuesday. So, anyway, October with October first, uh, October, not October, y'all. August, sorry. Well, it's like, well, it'll, we're not almost there. Yet. It'll be October before we know it, pretty much, mm-hmm. right? Um. So again, hit the subscribe if you haven't. The like, comment, share, notification bell. Um, any other links you need are in the show notes. So with that, see you at the next reaction.